Now this is a story all about how I don't want to be asexual anymore, now I'm gay. Now this is a story all about how this weird side of the gacha community fetishizes the LGBTQ community for some reason. This is a story all about eye contact is spaghetti. Right, hello Gamer Virgins, it's Ben, and I, I don't really know how to do this intro. I think I'm a little bit scarred from like the thousand plus comments you guys left on my video going into a little bit more detail about what gacha heat is. And I think it's actually scarred me, so thank you so much for that. You took away my innocence. Forget the chum bucket. This is personal. Yeah. I also want to take this moment to thank Maddie on Twitter for making this fan art of me. I'm actually going to use this on my second channel banner. You are a massive simp and you still look like Billie Eilish. So thank you for the art. Today we are looking at some gacha life cringe. By the way guys, I cannot stress this enough. Remember that not all the gacha community is bad. It's just a small minority. I need to make that very clear. So please don't go and harass anyone who does enjoy making gacha content. By the way, I have a Discord server and Twitter. So follow me on there and send me any gacha you want me to look at in the future. Future. Okay, cool. Let's begin. She didn't tell her boyfriend she was having a pizza because he would think she's spaghetti. Because I was afraid you would think I am spaghetti. So as you can see right there, this is this is the IQ levels we are dealing with when it comes to this side of the gacha community. God damn. LGBT peeps be like, uh, you're in heat, right? Yeah. Oh, oh. Lamau, yes, that is totally what LGBT peeps are like, but then you just have the generic straight people who are just boring generic shit, and obviously gacha people are just like, uh, with them, but yeah, all you LGBTQ people, you obviously all must be in heat all the time, apparently, according to them. As an autistic bro, this is stupid, I am so mad. Finally, the autism freak is gone. Such a relatable moment when I guess your parents are just fed up with your autism. How do I delete Earth? If pans date for personality, then they would date anyone, including maps and siblings. Especially if it's just dating them for personality. No one wants to date a map. Why would anyone want to date someone who is attracted to children? It's disgusting. Stop trying to make maps a normal thing. Hurting spaghetti people is amazing. We get paid to hurt lonely people. Despite the fact that this is gacha cringe, it's literally like the worst story ever. It's so bad. Come on, kitty. Drink my milk. <laughs> this is so bad. This next video right here is possibly one of the worst things I have ever seen while doing these gacha videos. So just bear that in mind for what you are about to see. Actually, I've got to ask the question, how the frick do you even do that type of thing with a book? Is, is there some sort of like book you need, a speciality book? Has to be Nat Geo Wild, the 400 page one, not the 200 page, or you won't get the same thing? I don't know, this is so weird and uncomfortable. I'm going now, moving on. Who else wants to be a boy just to be gay? Ha ha ha, oh my god, now that I think of it, Painful things boys will never understand. I don't know what it is about the gacha community, but if you want to be gay, you have to be a boy. You can't be a girl who is interested in other girls. Apparently, apparently that just doesn't exist in their world. What would you do if your waifu existed and she's right next to your bed? Normal anime lovers. Well, nothing much. Just hope she's nice. Otakus. I would want to make her my girlfriend. Legendary weebs. I would kidnap her, photograph her naked in an abandoned warehouse, and make her my spaghetti slave. Wow, that really escalated quite quickly. Did you touch yourself without my permission again? S sorry master. Bruh, why are kids even making this type of content? When I was this young, I used to pretend that like, the raindrops on the side of the car windscreen were racing each other. I don't know why kids are getting any enjoyment out of making this type of gacha. And can someone also tell me in the comments down below who Lumi is? I keep seeing a lot of comments about it, but I don't know who, who they are. Uh, do you know what? I don't even know how to pronounce this name, so we're just going to do one a little bit more suitable for my English. Uh, Cheese, you doing okay over there? I don't think she is, and this is disturbing and weird, and I'm getting it off my screen right now. This is beyond gacha logic. Let me just find another mini-movie. Kiara, if that's how you pronounce the name. I don't know, we'll just call her Broccoli. 
Broccoli, why do I wear the blindfold? I have a rare condition that makes me pregnant when I make eye contact with anyone. How did it happen? When I was eight, I put shampoo in my eyes on accident. The shampoo had a weird unknown substance that caused me to have this condition. When I was eight, I got pregnant after I looked at my friend. So I have to wear this blindfold at all times. Okay, Broccoli, I'm into gay animes, especially the ones that have dirty things. Ah yes, those dirty animes, those dirty gay animes, might I add. I mean, what does it need to have to be considered dirty anyway? God forbid if they hold hands in those animes, Whoa. Hey Siri, how do I delete the internet? I'm gonna crumb. And then, <laughs> there just has the comment here, I hope my mom doesn't see my internet history. Yeah, I think I'd be very worried if I saw my child was watching this type of thing. How old was everyone here who, f when they, how old was everyone when they first found this style of gacha content? I'm interested to know. 13 plus, it's basically this word, and why are you making this video? It's a freaking game for children. Saying yes to my boyfriend for 24 hours. Warning, 13 plus. Now, I, I don't know what you're possibly going to show in this for it to be, I guess, allowed for 13 year olds or older to watch this, but it's actually age restricted, which normally <laughs> consists of it having to be for content which is over the age of 18. And how does it have 1k likes? I mean, I might have to go back and check this video sometime to see where it's at now. Not only is the imagination of the kids making these gacha life stuff that bad, it's just, it's just so shit. I mean, look at this. Point of view, you would be helping your older brother move into his new house, and when you're bending over, he takes his clothes off, and you see him, and he says this to you. Wanna suck. <laughs> God damn. So we actually have this little movie we're going to watch now. I got this sent to me by someone who's recently watched my videos, and I haven't watched it before, so I don't know if this will even make it in the video. But let's see what goes on in this video. Here you go. Eats her cookie. Uh, I wish I was that cookie. Okay, where's this going to go? Puts head in oven. She has a nice <laughs> booty. Fingers prostate. Dies from pleasure. Pretend she is senpai. What is going on here? Comes. <laughs> What? Okay. <laughs> Why? They are all 22 Omega butts. What did the, what did I just watch? Dies from pleasure? What? I mean, I'm just looking at this subreddit right now, and honestly, every single time I look at it for a video, it's just getting worse and worse in the sense of how graphic it is. So I think I'm going to have to leave the video here for now. I just can't believe it's kids that are the ones that are making this. Like, where are their parents? In all honesty, because if I knew my kids was making were making this type of content, well, it'd be straight to garbage island for them. But I hope you gamer virgins enjoyed the video. My socials are below. Have a wonderful day and I will see you simps next time. Till yourself.